welcome to my channel. I am Yuzetta Lee Storm and today I will be showing you how to make peanut butter bread, dairy free and egg free. So keep on watching to see how that's done. Okay, we're going to start off by preheating our oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or about 175 degrees Celsius. Then we're going to take two tablespoons of butter. I'm using Miyoko's brand butter and we're going to spread this into the bottom of the pan. Now we're going to take four tablespoons of brown sugar and add some peanuts to it. I'm adding about a quarter of a cup and then we're going to mix this all together and then sprinkle it into the bottom of the pan. Now set this aside and we're going to move on to the batter. Okay, we're going to start with the wet portions of our ingredients first. So we're going to start off with a quarter cup or 82 grams of applesauce. One cup or 227 grams of packed brown sugar. Now we are going to take our brown sugar and we are going to whisk or beat it into our applesauce. Next, we're going to mix in two tablespoons of peanut butter. Next, we're going to melt down two more tablespoons of butter. Now that our butter is melted, we're going to go ahead and add it to the rest of the mix. Okay, the last ingredient to our wet ingredients is one cup of buttermilk. And what I have here is a quick vegan buttermilk, which is one cup of soy milk with one tablespoon of lemon juice. This is not on the scale and I do not have a weight for it because of the way that I had to make the buttermilk. Okay, now we're gonna set this off to the side while we mix our dry ingredients. We're gonna start off with two cups or 261 grams of flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, one teaspoon baking powder, and now we're gonna sift these together. And then we're gonna stir in a half a teaspoon of salt. Now we're gonna add our wet ingredients to our dry ingredients. Now we're going to pour our batter into our pan and bake for an hour. I realize I may not have mentioned what size pan I'm using. I am using a 9 by 5 inch pan. Okay, so this is what it looks like right out of the oven and you do want to turn it out immediately because of the nuts and sugar that we put on the bottom of the pan. And there we have our peanut butter bread. The recipe and my social media are in the description box. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, please subscribe and you can also watch uh, the other videos I have linked up here. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.